I got a 3300 Joseph Groff with 3092 Chris Williams 3808 got Daniel Costa with a 3960 he's the number one guy in front of me I'll just follow him for a while, learn his line, learn what he's doing. Got a guy close behind me, uh, which I believe is Williams, right behind me. We're trying to pull away from the crowd. <clears throat> Daniel Costa, he's a pretty fast guy. I've raced him many times. He's from, I believe, Liberi Liberia. Um, Liberia, something like that. And he's a pretty good driver. That's a line that I see a lot of people take and I, I just don't, I don't take that line very often. So what I'm doing is I'm, I'll, I'll kind of explain what I'm doing as I'm going through here. There's a top of a hill coming up right here, right here is where I'm letting off, getting on a little break, a little about five, five percent break, trail break, and then getting on it at about 150 miles an hour. My goal is to come out of the turn three at the green light, be 153 miles an hour. I turn in, break up to 15%, get on the gas now, just about 50%, 60%, and then full throttle once I know I can make it. Turn in at the Pocono side and let off shortly after with a little trail break and get on it once I can. Ooh, a little tap of the wall. Let off right. Ooh, 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 ooh. Don't want him to come down on my nose. Gotta be careful. I could have messed his race up and mine. I gave room. Go ahead and uh, run your line, buddy. Run your line. Turn in, let off, brake. Later on, I'll start backing off the throttle earlier. Not fully, but backing off of it. <clears throat> the draft in these cars, for some reason at this track, doesn't work. <laughs> I don't know if it's a setup or what it is, but drafting is really tough. Got away from me a little bit, about 0.3 seconds away. 
I want to drive and get down to this yellow line. And it's okay to turn extra to get down to it, especially at the beginning of the run. Get on it. Seem to be a little bit better through turn one and two sometimes. He gets me here, so I don't, that line might be working for him. Keep up the momentum. I try to stay away from the wall because it gives a lot of, it'll put air onto my spoiler. Looks like we got about a 0.4 second gap between second and third, myself and number two. Well, caught up to him a little bit. I want to get down to this line, hug it a little bit, save some tires, get around the corner easy. I'm hoping I'm making him push. signs my turn end point <clears throat> my goal is to get back on the throttle once that curving starts out of two Woo, got a little loose There we go. We're on lap seven. Finally, it's working. <laughs> yeah, stretch it out a little bit from me. Try to catch him here. Get my marks. It's okay to come out a little wider, get a little more speed. As long as I can make sure I'm turned. Got third place about 0 0.2, 0 0.3 seconds behind me. Down, down. Go, 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 go. Come out. Right now, I'm pretty content. Pretty content. <clears throat> wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. I don't know when I'm going to try to pass him. I'll try at some point. Just need to hold this position. If I'm in second, that means I only got one spot to go. 
One car to pass. <clears throat> Come on. Let me get it. Come on. Come on. Let's get some. Pretty happy with second. That means I'm. I am three. So if I get second, I gain a little bit of I rating. Looks like I got a rock chip in my window. Guys throwing... Oh, there we go. Piece of rubber flew up and hit me. Putting a little bit of a gap between third. See if we can get something going. What lap are we on? We're on lap 13. Uh, come on, come on. Get my space back. I catch back up to him. I'm going to miss Pocono after this week. I like the Strike. Super big tri c Raceway. Looks like we got Nick Neven, which is a streamer. It's pretty fun to watch him and Gavin Lemon. And uh, anyways, his dad's in here, Alan Neven. He's currently seventh.
Oh, time to get down there to third. See if that works. Sounded like the number one car went down to third. Lap 15. Looks like Kevin Wren passed Blake Roebuck for 10th place. And then it looks like, uh, let's see. Blake got back past him. Looks like those guys are battling back there for 10th. Got a good run back there. See that on my SDK Gaming. Feels like it's doing good, but I don't want to miss it. I don't want to miss that shift because that could kill me. All right, lap 16. Looks like those guys, Blake and Ke Blake Roebuck and Kevin Wren, are battling pretty good for 10th place. And also, John Zyle. Kowski is passing Joseph Graw. That's happening just behind us in fourth place. Looks like those guys are going back and forth. <clears throat> and Joseph Graw passes John Beck. Oh, time to go. Time to go. All right, we got two laps to go. Let's see what we can do. Lap 18. Looks like Alan Neben crashed out. He crashed with Chris Graham. Alan jumped to the pits. Chris jumped to the pits. John crashed. A lot of crashing on this lap 17. A lot of stuff. Oh, there's me. I'm, there's my pass. It's talking about for P1. Williams passes Costa also. Daniel Costa gets past Williams again. It's all happening way behind us. So those guys crash into each other. Going into turn one. Chris Williams going to get past Daniel Costa for second again. And uh, let's see, Chris Corner passes Kevin Wren for eighth place. Looks like Joseph Groff got past Daniel Costa for third. Joseph Groff also passes William for second. <clears throat> Scott's. Winton passes Adam Byrne for 11th place. And we got the white flag coming out. Robert Farnsworth is. Looks like he's passing Daniel Costa for fourth. Daniel must have some good damage on something. His tires are too warm. All right, we, all we got to do is get back to the end and finish this out and hopefully get a W. Just take it easy. Hit my marks. Don't have to go crazy. Just got to get around the track. All right, let's see. We do not have anyone behind us. That was a good win. That's a good dub.
Let's go burn her down. Yeah, baby. Let's check this out real quick. As I was going, I was reading all this stuff right here. Let you know what was going on. Kelly Pointer, 33, gained 64 I rating. Ooh, that's going to put me at 34. Getting close to my all-time high. I think 35 was, maybe not. Joseph Groff finished second. Chris Williams, Robert Farnsworth, Daniel Costa went from first to fifth. Uh, plus 11 for Nick Baker, plus 5 for Blake. We got Chris Corner with 13 spots gained. He was the 18th highest side rating with 17.94. A few guys missing out. Uh, looks like Alan Neven lost 16 spots due to a wreck. And that's it. Let's see. Uh, see what's happening in the race. Quick. Follow Costa. Oh, wow. Let's see what happened right there. Oh, looks like seven just got in the back room a little bit looks like 12 came down into 8 oh that's what happened oh that happened later 23 gets into the wall probably going to be a lot of wall smacks yep wall smacks all over Ooh, big wreck. A car slides right up and down. Takes himself out. 17 car. Oh, gets hooked. Oh, that, that would hurt. That was looked like a professional race. A Daryl Walter, I believe, crashed like that in the 17. Maybe. <laughs> 22 gets in <clears throat> back of John. Here we go. Sip the flower. There's my pass. Oh, there's the wreck right there. Whoa. That was weird. Catch up to Costa. That's it. Hope you guys all enjoyed that. That was fun. That was a good race. I had a lot of fun. Thank you. God bless. Love you guys. I'm out. Peace. Wait. I'm going to stop. Glad I saved it at least. <laughs> Let's check something real quick. Race results. Since you guys are still with me. Up to 3.9. Up to 34.47. Let's look at that. I gained 138 points. Let's go ahead and look at that thing right there. Uh, results. Standings. Arca. Let's see where I'm standing. Standing 31st. So second page. Right here. I have two week counts. I have four races, one win, three top fives. Everybody's got two weeks, so I've raced every week. 
Uh, I thought I had a pull. Average start is third place. Average finish fourth. 95 laps. I've led two of them. <laughs> I have zero incidents, so that's good. I like being clean. Let's do check some all division. Let's do division two. Division two. So I'm on page one. Let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Ninth place in division two. Two hundred ninety points. Just thirty nine points behind. Let's just do Northwest. Currently second behind Lee Tankersley by six points. He's got 16 starts, two wins, nine top fives, one pull, seven start, five. That ain't too bad. He's led a lot more laps than me. Let's see what his, he's got a 37.93 I rating. I have a 34 now. Let's check something. Remember for three years. Wow, I've been racing for three years here. Stats. What's my highest IRA? Thirty-two. I think this might be my highest ever. Nice. So, a 34 is my highest I rating I've ever gotten. So, that's cool. Currently, I have ovals, 82 wins, and 100, or 1,116 starts. I think that's 83 now. Plus one, plus one. I have a ton, I have poles. I, I do good at that. I really do good at that. This year, I have six, seven wins and 103 starts. About a 6% average. Not too bad in the top five, thirty-eight percent. Laps led twelve. It's my best year in laps led. No, oh dirt. I do all right in dirt. Top fives. I see thirty-eight. Let's do ovals only. So best year in that. Average win percentage. I'm falling, but I'm racing against a lot better people. Uh, laps led. Not too bad. Fifteen hundred over the year. Average incidence three point four to two point six in twenty twenty two. That's a lot better. I was doing really good in wins. Eight point five. <clears throat> I don't know where I, where I was at twenty twenty two. So. 29 29 to 31 I was just running in that line and this year I've gone from that 31 to 34. Let's see where Menard Series is running this this uh, this time. Trucks are at Chicago Land. GTs are at Daytona. Nice. What I got? What I got? What I got to buy? See what I have to buy. I don't know what I gotta buy. Probably says it over there. But that's not where I clicked. Where's that Fuji? Oh, maybe it's because it hasn't refreshed yet. Why do I? Why is it saying I have to buy that? I don't have to buy the Fuji track. They just race there. Series. Schedule. Yeah, they're not 
racing there now. Oh, I guess June. Let's see, July, June 27th. So now they're at Daytona. Okay, it's because it was last last time. I don't have to race that. Do that. Cup cars at ooh Chicago Street. Yeah, about time. Where's Xfinity? Xfinity is going to be at Chicago Street too. Nice. I wish the trucks were there. Let's see how many are at Chicago Street. Oh, they're at Nashville for the open set, I guess. So, NASCAR's going to Chicago. Open setup, or the fixed setups. What? Oh. Oh, no, there it is. I don't know what it's doing. Anyways, thanks guys. I appreciate it. Thanks. God bless. Love you guys. I'm out. Peace.